In these next two minutes, I wanna help you understand the phase that your three-year-old is in. This is the phase when anything can be imagined and everything can be a game. And one curious preschooler wants to know, why? Your role is to embrace their physical needs. Life for your three-year-old can be confusing. It's okay to throw a ball, but not a rock. You can hug a friend, but not squeeze his neck. Your three-year-old is learning the rules for life and encountering some necessary discipline. You help them learn when you engage their senses because they think like an artist. You capture their heart when you cultivate their self-control. They want to know, am I okay? And you coach their moral abilities when you discipline consistently because they're motivated by safety. This year, you will incite wonders so your child will know God's love and meet God's family. Your three-year-old has so many questions. Some might be about creation, heaven, church, the Bible, and some of their questions might already be hard to answer. But don't panic. Just like other topics, answer faith questions as simply as possible. If they need to ask more, they will. Say things like, God made me, God loves me, Jesus wants to be my friend forever. How did the Samaritan take care of his neighbor? Can you let your friend have a turn? Let's thank God for that. Are you scared? Let's talk to God about it. Read simple Bible verses like, with God all things are possible. Use morning time to set the mood for the day. Smile, greet them with words of love. Use drive time to reinforce simple ideas. Talk to your toddler and play music as you go. You can use cuddle time to be personal. Spend one-on-one -on -one time that communicates love and affection. And use bath time to wind down together, providing comfort as a day draws to a close. So remember this, every phase is a time frame in your kid's life when you can leverage distinctive opportunities to influence their future.